Well, it's hard to, to overemphasize those data. It's so important what's happened in the treatment of lung cancer. I was saying earlier that you know, I have friends in thoracic oncology who've opened outpatient clinics now because whereas in the past no one lived long enough to come back and be seen, now they do. Uh, we've increased the survival nearly five-fold wow. for patients with non-small cell lung cancer by virtue of the introduction of immunotherapy, in particular Keytruda. And it was only a few years ago, actually just about three years ago, that we obtained the first data that showed that Keytruda could be used effectively in that setting. So it's really a remarkable change. Well, and it's remarkable for that set of patients for whom it works. Yes. But then there are some patients that don't get that same benefit from right. these incredible immunotherapies. Right. Uh, and we talked with the CEO of iAvance this morning, yeah, one sure. company working on what happens to the patients who, sure. you know, Keytruda stops working for them sure. in melanoma. Are you looking at that space at all? Well, we always have. Mm -hmm. And what we began in a fairly straightforward way by asking the question, when will monotherapy, single agent therapy with Keytruda work? And we looked very broadly across a very broad range of tumors, more than 30 different tumor types. And the answer is you see responses in at least 26 of those different tumor types. And then we ask, well, how durable are those responses? And the answer is they're quite durable. And then we ask the question, what can we do to improve the response rate so that more people benefit? And for that, you need combinations. Probably the biggest change that's gone on now that we've really pretty much completed our monotherapy studies, which began just about five years ago, now that we've completed our monotherapy studies is the introduction of combinations that further improve the response rates. And that's what's going to have the biggest effect going forward.